Um, so, sorry, Sam. He was making faces. Thank you, Bill. So, this is my artistic representation. So, I put a Mormon church, probably from Utah. You know, it's a good picture, and this is the first one on Google Images. And, uh, <laughs> First of all, my book was called Unbroken by Laura Hildenbrand, and uh, it was about Louis Zamperini. And, and I keep forgetting book? what it's called. I think it's My 100 Adventure Adventures, but I never really paid attention. And, <laughs> and she lives on a beach, so I kind of painted a whale, but I don't like it at all. And then um, she meets this homeless guy who her mom ends up marrying, so I drew a homeless guy musical soundtrack right here. And the six parts of the plot and the comparative section, the figure of language, and the imagery, and the timeline. And, yeah. Do I have to say what I like about it? Yes. Okay, I like the homeless guy sleeping on a couch. Because <laughs> <laughs> I thought I drew that very well. Some guy. Very good. Down and had to survive in the middle of the ocean on a raft for 30 days. And then I have then I have my soundtrack all across the bottom. The comparisons, so I compared it to two other books and then some TV shows and a movie or two. And then here's my figurative language throughout all the books. Idea. It kind of leaves a surprise element there to me. I add surprises. Okay, um, mine <laughs> is about, um, it's a book called Ghost Hunter. Um, it's a series of six books, and uh, it takes place in 6000 BC in Europe when it was just a huge forest. Um, and this is my settings and all the other stuff. Um, my timeline is down here. I did. My, I drew two of them. And this one is a wolf howling at the moon. And yeah, this one is an example of what the force would be like um, in the summer because I couldn't get one in the winter. Um, and this one is the main characters. Yeah. Um, for my music, I did. Um, I found these old CDs I had. Um, it was by a man named Carlos, and it's hard to ex like to ex to pronounce his last name, but it starts with a K. And um, it just expresses the snowy theme of the book, um, how just like a sort of like twilight-like thing. 